Hello, Tools. Bienvenidos. Welcome to Handy Manny's School for Tools. I'm Manny, and today we're going to learn how a socket wrench works. Handy Manny's School for Tools. We are learning what to do. To pull a nail or turn a wrench. To fix a bike or build a bench. Handy Manny's School for Tools. Changing a bike tire is a hard job. And if your tire is flat, like the tire on Marcelo's bike, it's even harder to ride. Who knows what kind of tool is good for taking off a tire like this? A hammer! A hammer can bang it out! <laughs> no, bad. Not a hammer. The best tool for taking off this tire is a socket wrench. Of course! Claro que sí! <laughs> Wonderful! Does anyone know why we need a socket wrench? Oh, oh, I know it! I know this one! <laughs> Pat? Um, no, I don't know. I'll show you. Pick me! No, me first! A socket wrench has a special slot. Or socket that has six sides. See? And I fit tight over a six-sided nut! That's right, Tix. Bueno, it is my turn. A socket wrench also has a special mechanism called a ratchet. That's so I can only turn the nut in one direction. See, in this direction, nothing happens. But in the other direction, I can loosen the nut. But the nut's just spinning around. And that's right, Rusty. Does anyone know why? Oh, oh, oh! Um, the... Uh... Does it have anything to do with hammers? <laughs> no, Pad. But it does have to do with another tool. To remove a nut like this, you need two socket wrenches. One on each side. I'll hold the nut steady, and I'll turn the other one loose. Yay! It worked! Some jobs take more than one tool working together. Now all we do is put on a new tire. <laughs> and then you need both of us to tighten it up. Perfect. And that's how a socket wrench works. Two socket wrenches together. <laughs> Muy bien. Very good. Animal is cool.